Hello, konnichiwa. My name is Mr. Honda Kawasaki and I'm going to be your examiner for today in this interview stage of your application for a Japanese driver's license. Just a reminder, I'm going to be asking you questions and I want you to give me your most honest answers. Okay, good day. Are you ready for the test? Okay, cool. So let's get started. When did you take the test? Where did you take the test? What kind of test did you take? How long did you wait before they issued your card after the day you take the test? How did you learn how to drive? How long did you practice driving before you applied for your driver's license? How often did you practice driving? Did you practice alone or did you practice with somebody? Did you enroll in any driving schools? When did you get your driver's license card? Where did you receive your card? Did your examiner give you instructions before you taking the skill test or during the skill test? How many times did you take the test? Would you mind telling me why did you fail? Could you narrate? What did you do during the skill test? How much did you pay? How long did it take you to do the entire skill test? Did you have a student permit before applying for your driver's license? How did you acquire your student permit? Did you bring your own car when you did the skill test or did you borrow a car from the licensing office? What type of vehicle did you use during the skill test? Can you drive both automatic and manual transmission vehicles? How many questions did you answer during your written exam? What were the documents that you prepared when you applied for your driver's license in your home country? Did you receive your driver's license card the same day that you took the test? Did you apply for your driver's license in a branch office or from a main office? How long did it take before you applied for your non-professional driver's license after you acquired your student permit. Well, Miss Andrea, based from your answers and from all the documents that you have provided, well, I guess, congratulations. You passed the interview stage. Please get yourself ready for the skill test. And yeah, so those were the questions that they asked me when I did the interview stage of my application for Japanese driver's license. That was last year. Yeah, that was July of last year, 2019. If you notice, I was trying to ask you seriously because that is the exact tone that the examiner or the officer from the licensing office is going to give you. Now that you already know the questions that you can expect them to ask you during the interview stage, this time I'm going to give you some key points, some reminders, in order for you to finally nail that interview. So before you go and have your interview, please remember to memorize all the details, all the dates, all the numbers, all the figures, all the documents that you're going to submit uh, during the screening process because all those documents will serve as their uh, reference in doing the interview. 
with you. Another, be consistent. Be consistent with the details. Remember that the officer is going to ask you the questions repeatedly to assess the accuracy and consistency of the details that you are providing. Three, less talk, less mistake. Answer only the questions that is being asked because if you keep on providing information which is not being asked, then you might sound defensive and yeah, you might fail. Number four, answer promptly and smartly. Don't be nervous. Show them that you know what you're talking about. Show them that you are sure and you're firm with your answers. And number five, show them that you are firm with your intention to pass the Japanese driver's test. So yeah, those are the questions and the tips that you're gonna need in order to pass the interview stage of your application for the Japanese driver's license. So I wish you all the best and do your best.